Okay, I'm under the car. I've got the car jacked up. Well, it's not jacked up, it's on wheel ramps, but I have four jack stands for safety. Took off the wheel well shield. Uh, there are two bolts, it's like one here and then one up there. Then the rest are, are just screws. The one that's behind the axle over there is uh, kind of hard, so I took a drill bit attachment. Um, like a tiny little Phillips head attachment and got that off by hand because there's not enough room to put a screwdriver back there. And here's the transmission case. It's got a little bit of an oil leak on it. Or a, I would guess, transmission fluid leak. It's probably a seal there that's gone bad. And imagine that seal would be easy enough to replace. The purpose of this video is a complete head tear down. Why am I under the car if I'm tearing off the head? Well, for this model of 626, you can't get off the heat shield off the engine because the distributor is in the way, so you have to take off the pre-cat, uh, which I don't even think you can see that. It'll be attached to this downpipe up in there. And then you have to take off the downpipe and flex is included with that all the way up to the catalytic converter. Loosen that up and then go up top to the cat, pre-cat, and remove the bolts from that and then the downpipe should drop right off. Then I'll move my way up to the exhaust manifold. And I want to get the exhaust manifold off, but I'm not sure I'm going to have enough time. I got rained out yesterday, and it looks like I'm going to get rained out again today. I'm not sure I'm going to have enough time, so I'm just going to get to it. Start pulling off bolts. Oh, God. Yeah, I didn't use a PB blaster on these. And... Uh, I don't think I'm going to get these off. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh. Oh, come on. I know you can fit on there. <clears throat> Damn it, I might need a breaker. Oh, there we go. Come on. Burn. Oh, okay. You just want to loosen those up. I want to get on there. No one can get on there. Oh, that bolt's rusted through. That's shorter than the other one. That's why. I'm gonna have to get a wrench on that. Hey! stays loose but it's on a bracket like a, a curl that'll just when you loosen it up enough you can pull that lock over that curl I don't think I'm skinny enough to fit back over there <laughs> um hmm. how am I gonna get to you I'm too fat oh god okay this should be a laugh got a mambo Mamba. Samba? Limbo. Limbo. That's the one. That's the word. Okay. I got my jack stand, so I'm not really too afraid if it comes down. Um, oh, wait. I positioned my jack stands wrong. If the car comes down, it's going to come down on the suspension. And I'll still get crushed. So, hopefully, the cross motor is strong enough. I don't know, but you know what? Hey, fuel lines. Oh, Christ, my fuel line shield is cracked to crap. Fuel line shield is gone. Looks like someone took a BB gun to it and just shot it out. Rocks. Other than that, everything under here looks good. There's like no rust. I bet most of you guys up north would love to have something like this. There's like almost no rust. Ugh, that bolt is nasty. Yep, that's another 12 mil on that. Come on, bitch. I'm not going to be able to get enough leverage. Nope. Downpipe wants to move with it. Oh, Christ. 
that is rusted shut. Only rust in my car happens to be on the downpipe catalytic converter um, gasket. And there's no room back here. So I have like no leverage with these jack stands in the way. This is making a whole bunch of noise. Ah, oh, Christ, come on. Okay. I'm gonna have to call a rain delay. Another one. Second day in a row. God damn it. Why not? He's the one that rusted my catalytic converter shut. I'm defeated by God. Second day in a row. Yeah, I can feel the cold rush of air and drops on my legs, but I still don't want to move. I like it under my car now. Oh, my engine hangers are good. Or my engine hangers. Wow. <laughs> Exhaust hangers, whatever you want to call them. I have some new polys I'm going to replace those with. But you know what? I think the stock ones are pretty good. Unless, you know, you go with a larger diameter pipe. I think the, the stock pipe is 1.5, maybe 2. <sighs> Christ, that's it. I'm starting to get rained on. I'm out. Do I have to take the whole thing down? I didn't even... What did I get done? I got the freaking shield. Five minutes. God. God, God. It's the second weekend. Last weekend it did the same exact thing. Same exact thing. Started raining at two or three every day. 